got you.
ございます。
seeing a hyperactive kid who's like, oh, go, 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 just barely even acknowledge your presence because they're just that lethargic. Not because they're into, like, whatever they're doing. Next is the type of dog. Wake up, you go downstairs, he acts almost as, pretty much the same way he does when you get back from being away, which is like super excited and you're like, yay, you're up, you're up, yeah, you're in the living room with me. We go his butt and what the man you play with him and he just his 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 way of acknowledging that I came into the room was kinda like look at me a little bit with like bloodshot eyes and just his toe just been like where, where usually it's like he's wigging, wagging his tail so much his butt is gone. This is the reason why dogs with stubby toes end up getting the nickname Wiggle Butt. It was the complete opposite though. But yeah, the vet said that they were fine. I Personally, I really wish they had done um, blood tests. It's just because he seems better doesn't mean that the issue is gone. I'm still worried about him. He's still not like back to 100%. But Hurry, there's the next ring. I mean, it shows no signs of anything being like seriously wrong with him now. And he's perking back up more each day. Except for right now because his mom and Rick are um, away in Africa. Uh, way in. Each ring before they turn off. What the heck was that sound, man? They're in Virginia, so he, he's like, Mom and Dad's not here. I'm so sad. Cause that's how he is when they're gone. Still want to go and watch you? Oh yeah, that will perk him right up. In fact, it w they put the leash on him to take him in the to the vet, and that perked him up before he even went. Yeah, like super excited the moment Rick put picked up the leash. But like before they went, he, he wasn't eating, he wasn't drinking. <laughs> then they got home and he drank a whole bunch of water. He's been eating fine since. Fine for him. Um, anyways, the definition of fine for him is a lot less eating than it is for a lot of dogs, so. But that's normal for him. Rip. I, I messed up again. Yep. Because he... There are days he goes completely without eating anything. But that's just normal Dexter behavior. It, mom, mom thinks he's like anemic or something like that. Not anemic. Anemic is blood. Um, anorexic. Just because, because there are days he really just does not eat anything. Especially when they're away. He's eaten since they've left though, so there's that. He's not as bad about not eating the first couple day, day, day or two when they go away. He still requires someone to be in the room with him to eat, but he'll eat. But he still has days where he doesn't eat. It's just not as often as it once was, but it's still like the normal behavior for him. I think he might have been just like really dehydrated. Because they had fed him a, like leftovers of a sandwich with something called beer cheese at him the like, previous day. And it's possible it was a reaction to that, and may or maybe that that got him dehydrated because he wasn't eating or drinking either afterwards. So until to after, where the heck is the next thing? There it is. Um. Yeah. He seems he's doing better. 
now that he's eating and drinking. So he might have just been dehydrated. But I'm not, I can't really be sure. Which I'll probably take him for a walk after the live stream. If it's not too hot. But it will be like the heat of the day, so I'll, I'll check the temperature first and then if it's too hot, I'll take him for one later on. But I haven't take, taken him since he got back to, from the vet because I wanted to make sure he continued to improve first. Alright, so let's see. You return to the geologist and do that. Alright. But she has continued to improve. He's just still a little off since going to the kennel. And, and I'm not sure why. It could simply be the fact that it stressed them out a lot. Is the, the dogs there were barking quite a lot. Ow. Not mean to do that. Alright. Oh, I'm probably not going to get him this time because of that. to my research. Bye, 
All right. It might work to count. Okay. I'm gonna grab this other. For your sacrifice, cell. I offer you a power cell. You gonna stay up here this time? Huh? You gonna stay up here with me? Yo, puppy dog. Hi. Orbs to be able to. Oh, great! That great I can get the get the cell from him for that. Yeah. He is still up here. He's just over on the other side of the desk. <laughs> Turn towards the exit and look back at me like, "Are you coming?" And I was laying down. All right. I'm gonna go. <laughs> Yeah. Oh come on. Can't jump over that for a shortcut. conversation with Ariel about her broken video and that's pretty much what happens when videos get glitched out there doesn't seem to be a lot that's salvageable unless it's just like if, if it if it gets corrupted after it's recorded and saved it's just it's just gone It sucks when it happens, but it happens. That happened to me. I think there's a video missing from one of my playthroughs because it happened in a playthrough that I couldn't re-record without completely restarting the game. I'm not 100% sure, but I do remember that happening to me before. I remember when I first started, um, when I first started recording, I thought even just the, when Elgato messes up and it, towards, like, towards the end, I thought even just that meant I had to, Delete the video and completely re record it. And then I discovered the editing tool on YouTube and I used that for a while. They've taken the one I'm talking about, that particular tool, away since then. But then I started using Windows Maker, so. Now I can keep the footage and just splice the pieces together. There. And yeah, at least she got the computer working again. I I really hope for her sake that the fix is more permanent than the fix I had that I did when I ever I had blue screen of death happen to my computers. But then I, I think she said she took it to a professional, so, um... I might have... Might be your memory in the conversation. 
Ow! I hate electrified water. As much as I hate things in the water that will eat me. 